Stow away. Challenge no rock on right. Okay, so there's only one mid support. This is pretty heavy, huh? Probably just gonna do an arch. The arch is the only thing we can afford. What I need to think about is how we're gonna get C up here. Oh, we have hydraulics. Never mind, we have hydraulics. So this is gonna lower down, and then I want this to kind of flatten out. We only have that much money, which worries me a lot. I'm almost debating actually doing an under arch. Like something like... Oh, something like this actually is probably the move. No, this looks clean. This looks good. Oh, it holds up a little better. Again, I'm just worried about the wood on top. Oh, it gets so bad so quickly. This has to be steel, but then I'm just so broke. Let's just see if this idea works. It's only two and a half thousand over, so I can figure it out. All right, so it works really well with the steel. And then this is currently too much, so I'm gonna have to change that. But at least the concept that is there. Is there a way to do this with a shorter hydraulic? Something like this, or will this not support? Generally just want a shorter hydraulic, instead of having it be a less percentage, because I need to shave money, especially now. Uh, okay, it works. Ah, uh, the it pulls a little bit off. All right, so I guess I'm gonna straighten this out then. All right, I don't know if this will work. I also did, should have maybe considered a split joint. A split joint there could actually be really convenient. That actually might be really convenient sort of thing. So this, and then these are all ones, and then these are all twos. And then what I actually want to do is drag this down a bit and kind of bring this over. Let's see if we can connect this actually. It looks like it passes right through. Alright, we got to connect. Uh, we pulled a little too far, though. This needs to be shorter still, because I think this is going to rip itself apart. If it doesn't, that would be nice, because it is all attached. <gasps> Whoa! Fuck the bridge! We don't need it anyways! <laughs> Come on, buddy! Uh, we got a thousand to go. Let me drag this down. Hold on. Drag this whole thing down. And then let me pull this up a little. Let me do this too. A few more dollars to save. Alright, perfect. Shaved off a lot of stuff. This, I think, was the most stressed thing, so I don't have to really worry about that. Of course, they'll just make the back bridge more likely to tear itself apart, but it's fine. Okay, this connects nicely now. Uh, it's not over pulling. So, like I said, if you want to shave money, you just gotta make the hydraulic shorter rather than contracting less. Contracting less doesn't save any money. Oh, and actually, because it perfectly connected, it doesn't tear itself apart. This is clean. Cool. Right on budget. A perfect bridge. Not often that I get exactly on budget. And doing it with the weird little arch thing that probably is overcomplicating things is extra sweet. On to the third world. Wow, we're halfway through the challenge levels. Loophole. Challenge additional plane. So I gotta loop this thing up here while dodging both these planes. All right, time for a very, very weird ass ramp. This guy's fast, right? He'll make it. Ah, this is good enough. Huh. That was easier than I thought. Why is the budget so high actually? Was it this high in the original level? I think it was actually, right? Because I did a much larger loop. Okay, let's carry on. The Big Dipper. The checkpoint has moved to the left. Bruh. <laughs> so, I gotta think about how I want to get this down here. It looks like we have to spring. There's no hydraulics. Wait, this is really slow. Oh, we're gonna do something stupid. This is probably dumb. I do want to attempt it. We are actually going to use springs for this design, by the way. This is 100% a spring design. Because it's going to gain massive speed, and we're going to use springs as shock absor absorbers at the bottom. Spring. 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 And then we'll do metal kind of going over this way. We'll see if the idea works, but we're probably going to have to tweak it quite a lot. Wish me luck. Alright, so already we actually... Well, I'm not even going to run it because I think we just want reinforced road in the middle. The worst part was actually the, the middle. Which kind of makes sense. Let's try it now. Ooh, only 60%. Oh god. Well, that sucks. It was too steep and then it just kind of fucked it. It tipped over is the issue. 
What if I had the design but it had to be less steep with springs while it's coming down? So, I'm gonna just delete this. What if it's something more... Something like this, maybe? Does this at least help brace it better? Alright, well, it's good for bracing it. It gets further, but it's still gonna break here. I think I'm just gonna crush this anyways. Actually, I think I'm just gonna delete the whole thing. Actually, I see... I, I want to try one more thing before I give up. Com uh, compressing this. Shit, don't even land! Okay, maybe compress this a little mo more. Yeah, you need to compress more. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> this is some weird shit. Yeah, I want to, one, not flip. And two, just drop down. Well, here's how we make it not flip. We do one of these. I think. It might be a little bit positioned off, so it's not gonna work. Oh, it actually, well... Not only did it not flip, but it also hit the checkpoint. Holy shit. Damn, that was actually the best it did. I think I really just need to redraw this. Let me try something here. I'm gonna try a big arch with rope. This is my last attempt with this idea. Then I'm gonna get rid of that arch. If I can get it to, like, not tumble, that'd be pretty cool, actually. <laughs> that was pretty cool, right? That almost worked. Ah, oh, shit, but it did a wheelie and it landed. It was like dancing up there. Yeah, it moves. It was actually slick. How do you make a tractor do that shit? I think what I just need to do is compress more. So even if it wheelies, maybe it'll hold. Mmm, we'll see. <laughs> Holy shit, it's an actual working idea. <laughs> they said it couldn't be done. The weird springy arch rope bridge is less than 9,000 over. We have shaved way worse before. So, uh, let's get this started. First things first, let me try getting rid of this and then moving this up. Just a very simple wall brace. This is already a huge chunk of money if it does work, but it might be a big difference. I mean, underbelly supports are usually huge. Oh, come on. I think we need that still. I think we still need something there. Uh, it's pretty cool. Let's keep this going. I want a, this to be higher and this to be wood. I want oh, a little bit at a time. Just a bit at a time. I probably should make that road shorter. So the wheelie isn't as vicious. And then we will have to worry even less there. We have $3,000 to go on this design. We're going to get there. Here's an idea. I probably don't care about those being reinforced. And we'll move this up. Yeah, the purpose is simple. They don't need to be the expensive type. Less than 3,000 to go. How much steel do we really need? We're gonna get rid of a lot over here, actually. Got rid of a lot of steel on that side. This is kind of risky, but we only had 84% stress over here, so maybe that's really solid. 90-something? 90 94? That's not bad. 741 to go. Yeah, I'm sure we could fix the arch. Or we could just replace some of this stuff with wood, and it'd be fine. Ah, uh, this was actually a bad choice, I think, for to replace with wood. This is gonna probably break. That's fine. So, there's a lot of steel over here. Can we just raise this up? Just lightly up, even. 95, I saw? $60,000. We should just go all the way at this point. 98% stress. Only $150. It really shouldn't be that much harder than just doing this. Here we go, let's see if it works. Ooh, no, that's actually important steel. I never would have guessed. Well, it makes sense though, the more I think about it. I think if I just raise this up more, we might be good. Here we go. The ultimate spring bridge, if this works. This will be my best spring design. Oh, it's gonna be close though. The wall brace is less powerful here. This could tear apart, this could tear apart. And these roads in general undergo a lot of stress. Oh, we did it. There we go. Barely not breaking, by the way. All right, very cool designs. Let's move on. Compression. The challenge is they added a boat and increased the budget? Why would they give us more money? 
Well, the boat looks pretty hard. And we don't have a hydraulic. All right, so here's how this is gonna go. Bottom road is gonna be something like this. And then it's obviously gonna be weighed down by springs. So it can go down while it's driving. And then top road is gonna... Can I... I think it has to dip a little bit. This will just be static. Do spring muscles even do anything? Yeah, they suck. That's what they do. I think I'm actually gonna commit to reinforced roads here to have this be stronger. Because I'm gonna just have springs dangling from this. Just neutral for now. Right. So let's see if this truck pushes down the bridge enough. Um, actually pushes it down a little. Didn't do as well as I hoped. Let me maybe actually get rid of a couple springs and then just connect them with wood like so. Something like this. I feel like the concept is actually there. I think I can also afford to do a little steel arch on top just to make this stronger. Less springs, but still springs. Like we need this to weigh them down. I'm almost considering doing one in the middle. Oh, come on. It's so close. We can just nail this like second try. We are with flying colors. Nice. It just barely squeaks by and it's just so structurally sound that it just doesn't tear itself apart. I don't think we needed more budget. What was the budget in the original? I, I wish the budget was lower actually. It was 20k? Let's go below 20k. It actually should be pretty simple I think. Do I need these? I do not. There we go, under 20k. Probably. Anyways, on to the next one. Doubling down. Additional boats. Well, wish me luck. This one's gonna dip down, then we're gonna have to do a bunch of hydraulics, basically. Basically, it's gonna be three sets of hydraulics. One in the middle, and one on each side. And then something like this, of course. <gasps> Budget! You're kidding me. This isn't even gonna be close to working, I don't think. I didn't even get a chance to do, like, the central supports. Oh yeah, it's 26% over budget. Oh, and I didn't even place everything. 29% over budget. I don't even know if this design is going to work. I mean, it is pretty sturdy now. But here's the thing. We're so over budget that the only way this will work is if I have to replace everything with wood. All right, well, good news is actually, I think it works. How's the center looking? The center? Oh, the center's close, but not quite. So the sides work actually beautifully. So I want to just run it right now to get it saved. Then all we actually have to shave is $11,000. Never mind. $11,000 we can work with. There we go. We got clearance, I believe. How often are streams going to be next month? Daily, actually. I love doing daily streams so much, I'm just going to continue it. So if you like the streams, uh, keep your eyes open for more. I'll be doing... And there's also a lot of games I want to play. So uh, daily is going to help me get there. Well, let's shave some dollars. First things first, I think we need this. But I'm going to try without it. Just because I don't... The, each of these supports are on one point now. And they're eventually going to be their own island. So I think they're going to tip over or something. I'm pretty sure we do need the connecting central. Yep. Yep. Call it. Can I do only wood here? Um, hold on. Pog? Um, I actually have extra money. I can do this then. <laughs> uh, let's shave a bit of money. Or not shave a bit of money. Let's reinforce the shit out of this. I'm pretty sure actually this entire thing needs to be steel. Also, here's what I think needs to happen. I'm pretty sure we can shave money here. Let's see how this works. Oh, maybe the center has to be steel. <gasps> Jesus. Overboat could be a possibility too, but this was pretty nice. Uh, it did stress a lot here, so I, I am thinking about the overboat idea. We have 4,000 to go. This is my best one yet. How cheap could we make this though, hypothetically? So this is 2,000 to go? It's wood though. If I replace that with steel on the top, it's not going to be much better. But it is pretty strong, I will admit. I'll have to clean it up. I can't make it be symmetrical because the middle hydraulic is asymmetrical. But this is 2,000 to go, so it's still good. Very nice. Uh, I can clean this up then a little on the bottom. Let's, let's make some of these lines straight. This is a little sloppy here. All right, this is 1,000 to go if it works. Beautiful. Can we get rid of, um... This might be important, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Like, the outside being steel is pretty good for the structure. Wow, we actually don't need it, though. That is crazy. We have 188 bucks to go. We should be able to get this. I mean, can we do this, too? Maybe it's only the bottom we need. 
Solid. That's a win, I think. Unless there's something unforeseen goes wrong. I believe we got it. The only thing that's actually sketch are the roads that are being pulled up. I mean, those could be stronger roads, but we don't need that. We just got it. Hold on, I'm a little curious. So I know we can get... Well, I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure we can get rid of this deal. All right, so let's see how it goes here. Wow, it works now. All right, so I guess because we added this on the top, we no longer needed this. Well, I'm glad the bridge got better. We are significantly under budget. And by significantly, I mean like 2300. I think we're going to move on to the next one. I think we'll return to this one day.